So as mm. you mentioned, brand new weave, brand new shirt, that's everything. Um. Yeah, we've started receiving the gift. You have a desk uh, <laughs> in the newsroom. <laughs> Please don't come a poor sign in my gallery. I beg you, which, which gift has come? I say we have started receiving the ah, okay. gift. So you have so set up the gift table. Exactly. Okay, okay, okay. That's exactly, <laughs> okay. exactly. So you are behind uh, the gift table? I am. And the moment number is equally active. So happy <laughs> <laughs> birthday. Oh, dear. <laughs> Do you know where my birthday is? Oh, you, the last time you put us to test, I passed actually. So what's you know, you know, it, 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 I, I, it, oh, it's okay. It, what is my birthday? No, it's this week. And we is know this it's week this week. When? Don't worry. Don't you see thou shall not test the wow. man. Trust me. It's not your birthday, not to the second uh, December. You see, that's how not test your man. When is my birthday? Don't oh, don't don't answer. Don't mind that. Either. Yeah. <laughs> you see. Don't answer. Look at no, you. we know, and heaven knows we Look know. Ah, of of in, in today in the era of technology, uh -huh. you uh -huh. think we, we will well, forget so anybody that day? We have actually it? saved it. Don't when worry. Don't worry. Oh, don't when worry. daddy can. If you don't tell anybody, when daddy can find out whether we show up here, we will celebrate you or not. That's it. We are saving a date. Ah. Unbelievable. That's <laughs> that <was> unbelievable. <laughs> no, yeah. You never change. You no. <laughs> oh, we know. And yeah. Ah, we know. You know when? Ah, why? Have you forgotten that we employed you? <laughs> why? We, we have <laughs> your father. <fun. laughs> you are not serious. One bit, I will get you. By the way, it's, it's, I will it's, forget your birthday. Your birthday is it's really a very violent week. I don't know. You see, serious, <laughs> yeah, like, very violent. How is it violent? Everything. <laughs> See, the people are hoping that some caps should pass them by, <laughs> and others are saying that no, their sons didn't use guns to shoot people. Uh, others are also saying no retreat, no surrender. No surrender. That 1986 movie is, is playing back. That, that's the point. That's the point. Others are just jumping and saying, what happened on the seventh day of January 1975 will repeat itself. <laughs> Charlie, by the way things are going, I mean, right now everybody is expectant or anxious as yeah. to how mm. things will unfold in parliament mm. yeah. especially with how things unfolded in court quite yeah. predictable you know yeah. when i mentioned to you that this is going to happen yeah. you said oh there's three weeks exactly <laughs> yeah but, but, but at least at least it's taking two weeks the chief justice and the panel the chief justice specifically says yeah. the case will be dealt with within two weeks 14 days to be specific right and 14 days if you take out the weekends it's still the three weeks. That's a substantive case. Oh. Yes, there have been other things that have been done that almost every legal luminary mm -hmm. I have heard Look, has said, Ah, I think this for the first time. <laughs> for the first time, yeah. a lot of the times you hear divided opinions, yeah. But for the first time, I think the chorus is quite, yeah, it's quite unanimous, as yeah. unanimous as the verdict the was, verdict was yeah. um, the ruling was, yeah. It is, um. And for me, I think that the, the, the apex court must, you know, take a step back and, yeah. and reflect. Yeah. Because even the people who would like, would have easily been in their corner yeah. are, are raising questions. They're like, you guys, you're making it difficult. Yeah. You're making it harder for, for us, us to teach the law, you. for us to defend you. And it's becoming quite too predictable. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. You cannot do that because justice must equally be seen to be done. Uh, now. I'm no lawyer. I don't pretend to be one. Mm -hmm. But I'm very logical. Absolutely. I know about separation of powers. I realize I asked Katie Hammond this question. I didn't ask him the question about separation of powers because I feel the uh, executive is more powerful than, say, the legislature and then the judiciary. Or the judiciary is more powerful or the legislature is more powerful. No. <clears throat> what I know is that the two are allowed to do their way. When there is anybody who's one way or the other, or they satisfy one way or the other, with the final outcome of something that parliament has done, then the person goes to the court, mm -hmm. especially when it borders on the constitution. Mm -hmm. yeah. They go to court for constitutional interpretation. Once the interpretation is done, it's up to parliament to incorporate that into its body of work. Yeah. Just like happened with the Justice Act. Yeah, yeah. uh, some aspects of the standing orders were flagged and then shut down. Mm -hmm. Parliament then consequently took the initiative to amend those provisions in the standing orders. Now, here we have a panel chaired by the Chief Justice telling Parliament what to do. <laughs> no interpretation of the Constitution. No, 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 yeah. no. no. The, the ruling has got nothing to do with interpretation of the Constitution. No. The state of execution. And then you have many people asking, okay, so a judgment can be stayed. A process from the court can be mm. stayed. An injunction can be placed. Mm. Right. But to say that a ruling that speaker has given should not be enforced, mm. 
Yeah. Just because you as the body tasked with the responsibility of interpreting the constitution, a sitting on it is problematic. They say it's overreach. Yeah. The judici judiciary is overstretching its bounds. Yeah. Mm. Then we come to what then will Parliament do? Especially given the fact that the two bodies, the two parties, have taken entrenched positions. Mm. Uh, majority before the ruling, and I'm talking about MPP caucus, says, okay, we said we we're going to boycott Parliament, mm. and now there's this ruling. We are returning to Parliament on Tuesday. Yesterday, the NDC caucus held a press conference and said, okay, we're still standing by the ruling of the Speaker, right? We are in a majority and will protect that particular status with every force mm -hmm. we go marshal. I asked the question of the, uh, the NDC caucus as to whether both parties should not defer to the speaker. Because as it stands now, it's what speaker says that what, what, will work. What, what, yeah. But speaker is in a very difficult position. Unfortunately, once again, yeah. the speaker has been put in a very difficult position. The last time he was, he decided, he, he stated, he put out his argument and yeah. said, for the sake of peace, yeah. I would let it slide. Yeah. I do not think he would let it slide for a second time. That's the point. That's, That's the, the point. thing. Because for once, I mean, you slap me once, I, I might let it go. Yeah. But the second time, it may be harder. So today, this morning, I can tell you that there will be delegations, meetings upon meetings, phone calls. Mm. And it's so typical of us. Yeah. The same thing with the E-Levy. Yeah. From the National Security Minister to a business person that I met who was sent to the Speaker's office. A very huge business person. And that business person's name always comes yeah. up when certain things happen. Right. I eventually, the, the, the MP in question said he, he had no... Uh, he was not going to yeah. say anything. For, for, but this one, I, in fact, if I was the one who went public, then I would have been the one to be called up. I mm. met the businessman ah. uh, in the Speaker's chamber. Oh. In fact, we, we the executives of the parliamentary press corps, we're going to see the speaker, right? And there? the speaker asked us to hold up because uh, the, the best said businessman had mm. come and he had done so on his own volition that uh, government business was going to suffer. And he has an interested party, he's an interested <laughs> party in government <laughs> business, right? So, <laughs> and then, like, uh, he and then government and then the speaker were mutual friends. You see, so he had gone there to put in a word. And of course, but the speaker didn't listen. The speaker said, in fact, speaker said, master your numbers. These guys are saying they will master their numbers. You to master your numbers. If you master your numbers, you are able to defeat it. Why not? Yeah. And if unfortunately they couldn't master their numbers. And that was what brought about the ELV back and forth. Mm. He went, he came back. He said he could have set aside what his deputy did. Mm. But he was not going to. Yeah. Like I said, if that speaker, that same speaker, sat in the chair on Thursday, the four seat will not, will not have been declared vacant. Yes. Mm. This is the new bourbon. Mm. If you followed parliamentary proceedings, you realize that this is a new bargain. Yeah. And that's why I think tomorrow, regardless of how we, unless there's no sitting, I mm. think the solution will be that they should say that there's no sitting. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, it's, it's for me, I, I am worried. Yeah. I am worried because, let me give you a certain, a setup where you are in an office space and you are my boss. Yeah. Bipo and I are colleagues. Yeah. And um, I feel that you side with people all the time. Yeah. Yeah. And we have an issue. I've come to you once, I've come to you twice, and all the time you have sided with people. Mm. Now, when there's another time anything like that happens, my mind is made up. I see that all the time um, my, bo my yeah. boss sides, sides with, with people. people. Yeah. Even when the facts glaringly are not in his favor. Yeah. When it happens like that one too many times, I will not find a need to come to you. Exactly. I would want to address the issue with the Frontally, face to face. Yeah. If I if I, I would have to adopt my different means of killing the cats. Yeah. And that I, for I, me that is where it is worrisome. That's where it is, yes. Because when everything gets chaotic, you expect that the Supreme Court, the apex courts, the highest in yeah. terms of um, laws in this country, mm -hmm. interpreting and everything. Mm -hmm. You expect that people should be confident enough yeah. to take their cases there yeah. and feel that if, if push comes to shove and we go to the Supreme Court, we will get justice. Yeah. But if increasingly the perception is that you will not get it, it is worrisome. And please, we beg them, 
they should listen to us because they are the last button to hit yeah. to keep us together. Yeah. Yeah. Look, look. For me, I think just to, just to add yeah. um, to what Naj just said, I think that the decision by the Supreme Court has some way somehow given legitimacy to the NDC's position that this election, if it doesn't go well for them, they are not visiting the Supreme Court. They've already said that a lot of people felt uncomfortable, but what this decision has done is that it has given some sort of legitimacy to the NDC claim that we don't think we will get fair fairness yeah. or justice in that court, and I, I don't think it is fine for all of us. Mm. Me, I'm, I'm happy that the case and i said it here that the case had been sent to the supreme court right because there's a need for us to have that finality now i've been thinking about article 97 and i think it's even problematic that article in itself is problematic mm. because if the argument is that it's futuristic and that you won't it will, enter it, parliament, it will be of no consequence and that's as the speaker said it's it's meant to be a deterrence. Exactly. But then again, in if it's to be futuristic, then it's then of no use. You, somebody cited an example. Now imagine, imagine, imagine your no, even your, let's use Atu Forsen. Uh, mm. Yes. Atu Forsen now decides the minority to leader mm. decides to then go independent, go independent I, in the next parliament. I think it was Omar Sanu. And, and, and then NDC will say that okay, don't worry, Atu Forsen, you remain put, in parliament and stay be put, our leader and be our leader, right? Because, and that would be the argument that if you are to look at the argument that, okay, the NDC will then have to write to speaker. Until NDC write to speaker, then you can say that uh, Atu Forsen has not left NDC. Yeah. So there's a need for a pronouncement on this. Yeah. There's a need, no two ways about that. However, and that's why I'm excited that Afeno Makin went to court. However, but you see the, the actually, processes. The processes. And that's where, that's where many of the lawyers and the law teachers that's where the problem is yeah. for them that where exactly was the action yeah. that um um afenyo Markin was speaking about this was something that was yet to happen yeah. so what was his action about and then the supreme court's um subsequent decision yeah. on what exactly because by the time he came to the court yeah. his facts what he has sent to the supreme court had yeah. changed yes. because the man had given a ruling yeah. They say it's not a rule. They say it's information. It's not enforced. Ex yeah, no, no, look, it gets confusing each day. Yeah, yeah. I mean, so what exactly is it? It's becoming... You see, I, I'm struggling to explain it because it's exhausting. Yeah. I, I was in court and bullet by bullet, point by point, the lawyers for the majority or yeah. less than a common African American had advanced the cause that there was mischief involved. Yes. And that the NDC was seeking to stifle government business. Absolutely. And that there is expenditure in lieu of appropriation coming. Mm -hmm. And if parliament doesn't return to the status quo, that is going to suffer. Uh, government business will grind to a halt. Uh, governance will grind to a halt. Mm -hmm. I can understand the sentimental aspect of all these things. And in, the, in their ruling, they made reference to all those. Yes. yes and that's was, why they even said beyond 10 days. Yes. How is that? interlocutory and you give perpetual it's hard yeah i don't know but it, how do you sleep at night <laughs> you know i sleep how do you no no, <laughs> oh, no i get you i get you i get you i'm just i'm just yeah I, but but and you know that 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 provision about cross carpeting yeah it's, it just didn't happen it just didn't find its way in our oh, books. Yeah. it was based on what happened Based on history, history based on yes. pre yeah. uh, past precedents, because in the past, governments, for example, the Nkrumah government is accused of some way, somehow using yeah. its powers yeah. to ensure that people yeah. defect yeah. during the arrest of Aram Ponsai. That's arrest. true. Yeah. So imagine if we have an executive that wants to use its power to the yeah. fullest, that yeah. wants to abuse every yeah. position of uh, every provision of our constitution, yeah. Yeah. deciding to go out of its way yeah. to for some way bribe or coerce others to yeah. join their folds. What yeah. it does is that it will have free hand in parliament. Oh, yeah. But parliament is a true representation of the people. Yep. So if you think that you came on the ticket of NDC, MPP, whatever party, you no longer mm. want to serve in that capacity. Quantity. Let the people decide. Exactly. That is the whole principle. Yeah. So Absolutely. we are asking as if this... Because you have actually betrayed <laughs> the people. So we sent you to parliament as an independent thinking person, right? Now you've told us that mm. next parliament, you will not be independent mm. thinking, right? You are caucus, you are joining a political party. Yeah. How sure are we that from now till then your independent mindedness has already shifted? But yeah. Because you need to please the people you are joining. But the thing is that 
I mean, so one will also say that that, that uh, decision, that argument may be flawed because the independent person you send will caucus with a party or other. Now you have made it express. Mm -hmm. it, you have put pen to paper. Yeah. If it's just where you are seated, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. That's allowed. Sitting arrangement, wherever you want to sit. You want to caucus. No, but if you're caucusing with them, means that when they make a decision, you are now, siding now with them. Now you have definitely stated that on paper, <laughs> so in fact and in deed, you are with them. That's the difference. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Aha. Charlie, <laughs> it's hard. Though. It is like, hard. Though, it's, it's becoming... and all of a sudden, notice of poll doesn't mean anything. Uh -huh. All of a sudden. Like, like why yeah. do we why? You flip, know, flop and... Yeah. It's, it's the same thing that happened to the birth certificate. When a critical document as such, yeah. when you're seeking your passport, you would need it. Your Ghana card, you yeah. need it. But then when all of a sudden... That document that <laughs> that is a source document for getting the most prestigious yeah. document in the country, which is a Ghana card. All of a sudden, yeah. because of some back and forth. No, Charlie. Nah, something here, right? I don't know. The NDC MPs in Parliament now constitute the majority caucus in line with the standing orders of Ghana's Parliament. We will jealously protect our new majority status and will not bow, retreat, nor surrender our lawfully end status. Whatever it is, Tuesday, Parliament is a place to be. I envy you. Look, at this point, I want to be a parliamentary person. Go. We should go. I think How about we do OB I think we should do more than stuff from Parliament. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, it, it's going to be, it better be an action movie. They shouldn't, they, they shouldn't but beat, there could be an anti -clamous. They shouldn't beat themselves. <laughs> that, that, that is also they, possible. They shouldn't beat each other, but yeah. it could be action packed. Yeah, but they can show something small in a TY. But uh, you know, one thing we are guaranteed is that they will not sleep. <laughs> 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 So the hotels so around, they, 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 the hotels they, around were cashing. Do yeah, you remember, we'll do you remember how the NDC went to sit at the majority side? Yeah. They, they took them by surprise. Yeah. And the next time, the MVP also went. Then they came in later. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you saw, you saw the, you know the poster picture for that. When I saw Usu Ekufu, Mrs. Sat on Akando, Akando, Akando. Beautifully, beautifully. Oh, speaking of which, she celebrated her 60th birthday over the weekend. Yes, 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 yes. And then this lady was there. When, when the she and they, yeah. they had a, a, yeah. a bit of a shake. Yeah. 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 Nice one. Nice one. <laughs> nice one. Nice one. So the 23rd, we will celebrate you as yeah, well. Yeah, you went to do your check. I went to do your check. I went to check anything. I was just, you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't. You, can, you, can. you went to check anything. I didn't check anything. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know that Nays are 21st, I didn't know. So, you actually said, I, I said, No, yeah. Nays, I know. <laughs> I don't know what I told you. Nays, be very, very careful. <laughs> Who asked you to say, say that to them? <laughs> you see, boys. Yeah, so anyway, it, it, it is what it is. I mean, tomorrow Parliament is a place to be. That's yeah, one thing. Yeah, it is. Guaranteed. Gadrafa, yeah. Gadrafa. Odeshi, we'll see who are the Odeshis. Because, hey, I'm wondering, the last time. Um, Muntaka was yeah. very active yeah. on the, in yeah. the ring. One thing we are sure of is that Muntaka will not fight for speaker. That's now. the thing. <laughs> he won't fight for speaker. Because they had, <laughs> they had a bit of oh, a, yeah, yeah, yeah. a face off yeah. whilst he was uh, the yeah. whip. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. Things, but has it been happen. in Parliament since his Yeah, music? yeah. He's been yeah. awfully he quiet. There. Very quiet. And he's been very active in the constituency as well. Okay. Uh, he's been talking, about, talking about Muntaka, Carlos is also not returning. So also yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've also not seen Carlos. Please. I've, no, I've yeah. not seen Carlos. Yeah. You yeah. haven't seen so, him. So that, that, that blow is what you describe as Kofi Oku in, in tree parlance. <laughs> anyway, let's find out what the dailies are reporting. Yeah. Um, okay, I'll start with the new crusading guide. When I finish, I'll go and look for the daily graphic. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So the crusading guide newspaper, front page, GRA boss in dirty Tata scandal. Ni Darko calls on OSP to freeze fraudulent contract. Okay, the Tata vehicle, right? Yeah. Are they still there? I didn't even think they were there. Mm. They're still there. That's fine. Still there. Alan paints Ashanti region yellow with massive walk. And Anidoho joins Duka uh, me and media team to showcase responsible um, small scale mining firms. And digital overhaul how NSS is using technology to eliminate fraud. And Supreme Court overturns Bagman's unconstitutional orders. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Directs Parliament to recognize the four MPs. I mean, so why is it that it was never it's, an it's issue? It's not even overturning. Uh, I think, I you think know, at the heart, yeah, they've not overturned it. It's no. just a freeze. Yeah. Um, at the heart of this whole thing, 
is a man the numbers issue yeah some of the things that have gone to the supreme court for the decisions that have come up yeah is because of the numbers. Yeah. If they enjoyed that comfortable majority of one six mm -hmm. nine, these things will not come up. Mm. You know. But hey, yeah. um, I think it's also a moment for us to do some reflection and do some changes mm -hmm. where necessary. So um, in the end, it's all good. Just that some someone someone else may come someday and also use it to their own advantage. Yeah, yeah. And just like how the Michael Quay decision didn't take long for Kaba to just come back. Um, government selects Quab LMI to complete Sanglemi housing project. Um, <coughs> you know one thing about this thing? I w I've always wondered, why did it have to wait till like almost the end of the tenure yeah, of think, the government? I, I think that's why I, I, I see action from uh, Kojo Pongkruma. At, at least there's yeah. that action yeah. to get that, a, a resolution. This could have been done from day one. That's and we I'm sat going. here and we said it constantly. That, see, you can prosecute whoever you want to prosecute. But the project belongs to Kenyans. Get mm. it to work. But perhaps it, it tells you the difference of um, getting... Doers in place. Yes. Yeah. Not putting square pegs in round mm -hmm. holes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Who was the first housing minister? It was Atachia. Yeah. Yeah. Was Atachia yeah. Then they gave it to us in Subwachi. And Atachia oversaw the payment of extra seven million for the same project. Ah, And then he said and he was he said going to court and staff. Mm. Then it he was the chief, the chief of uh, the chief it, director. Chief director. Yes. Yeah. And then um, we had a sense of watching. Yeah, we had a sense of watching coming. And after that, we've had Kujo Pongkruma coming. I think Atachi has spent. Atachi and a sense of watching. Yeah. They, they spent a whole their whole of their tenure talking okay. about how the state had been shortchanged yeah. and they will prosecute yeah. and they will prosecute, and while the state was sitting there yeah. rotting away. Any and there. You know, um, so yeah. I'm just, there's a part of me that's like, okay, the timing. But then, yeah. again, it's better late than never, they yeah, say. Yeah, but of course, uh, if you listen to Sam George, uh, wh whose constituency houses the project, yeah. talks about the fact that a uh, future NDC administration would You were talking about how the Alodio um, <coughs> owners, owners were not you yeah. know, um, involved in this. Mm -hmm. uh, well, let's see how that goes. I'm done with the new crusading guy okay speak. chronicle this morning baumia fires ndc secure your majority from voters and not in parliament that's that's interesting you know that who's that no 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 the, he, the said, uh, he said he said that it's the shortest um, um the shortest majority, majority ever it's four hours majority ever. yeah mm -hmm. yeah but one thing i know about our politicians is that before you know it, they are equally crying or they are equally the victim of the same thing. Yeah. And the victims now will also be the victors and right. be glorifying the decision and all mm. that, you know. Yeah. But talking, talking about securing of majority, I'm sure that you Kaysen will be leaving the platform as in securing majority, not through the polls, yes, but through probably other means. Um, <laughs> you get a point because it's easy, it's tactics. And antics. whatever strategies and antics in politics, mm. we've been here long enough to know that they all do it. Yeah, they all yes, do it's it. It's just a matter of time. Yeah, mm. uh, why Supreme Court overturned Bagwin's orders and NSS is now an authority? Hooray! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and Quam LMI consortium selected to complete Sagalema housing project. Uh, uh, hopefully they'll come and uh, explain that this Kwam doesn't mean Professor Kwam. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because people start, before people start reading a lot of When the family people start drawing yeah, budget. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Professor Kwam, Charlie. Yeah. Uh. And you find a lot of the people saying Supreme Court overturned. Yeah, yeah overturned. Exactly. It's not a substantive case, so yeah. how was it overturned? Yeah. You know. We were really um, excited, yeah. Uh, Are you done? Proverbs, quotation for this morning, Proverbs thirteen eleven. Wealth gained hastily will dwindle, but whoever gathers little by little will increase in it. You know, these are some of the quotations in the holy books that I disagree with. <laughs> what does it say? See, wealth gained hastily will dwindle. Wealth ha gained hastily okay. will reduce or dwindle mm. or fade away. If you are working. But whoever gathers little by little will increase in it. I think it does, you see, I think it's about legitimate means of making yeah, money. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't matter whether it comes boom or it comes more small. If it's legitimate, I want the boom. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Yeah, as long as it's legitimate. Yes, as long as it's legitimate. As as anyway. It's legitimate. All right. Daily Guide newspaper. We don't invest. <laughs> sorry. We don't invent majority, but we have jobs at NBC. <laughs> it says we get we win majority from the poll. Yeah, absolutely. Don't, we don't absolutely. use yeah. boardroom tactics. Also, yeah. foreign <laughs> hey, ministry. If it's about tactics. Antics. We don't know we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't, who have to do the tactics. And so. the antics. <laughs> Mathematics. <laughs> Chairman Ochi Mattis. Uh-huh. Yeah, so more. That one part. You tell me. I had a friend who was uh, P. Mattis. Uh, I've been yeah. he has he has seen all of you now. Now he's in the US. Ochi Mattis. <laughs> Foreign Ministry rubbishes 38.2 million visa claim. Also, Supreme Court vacates in court. Speaker reinstates Sorry, reinstates four MPs. Um, could woman here not the stood traditional council? What is it back and forth about the status of the Sibre Ekwamoe Japan the second? Also, police refused back a Vomawa assault allegation, uh, uh, according to the police statement. It's minor scratches, and they took the person to the, pol- the police hospital to be treated. Ah, now my, my not scratches a gentian valet. But you see, you remember the democracy half protest, yeah. the one we were told had uh was suffering from asthma yeah <laughs> we, we were told that the person yeah. had asthmatic A- attack, attack yeah d- delayed blah 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 yeah. so that one is not major that that is minor minor yeah. compared to yeah. the bruises yes, that you, you can't find your inhaler minor so scratches. then they struggled in finding your inhaler minor scratches yeah minor so, scratches it is gen valid that yeah, you, you don't take home. the person to the yeah but i get it. Just I, get you. Ah. I get you but the fingers the fingers you see the handcuff <laughs> Is it like a glove one? You see, handcuff must be like glove where you are expected to put your finger in there. They have to twist them. Yeah, I get it. But that's your wrist. When the fingers are involved... Remember, they need to now, when team, to. Team, team, like cra. Okay, no, so I get <laughs> it. Not like, because yeah, like a scratch is there. Yeah. Your wrist hold yeah, yes, baby. Yes, yes. Now, how does your thumb But you might never know. Plaster? Maybe there are new inventions relative to handcuffs, right? There's one that doesn't open and close at the wrist. <laughs> that one, you put your hand inside. But, but the hand that's right, of course, the part about the... All of us. The largely training. unfair treatment, that is fine. But yeah. the part about the hand that... There's you you all join. No, no, it's not that one. You, <laughs> <I know. laughs> you know I won't join. The thing is that... They, are, they accuse the police that, of course, the police is supposed to feed them. Yeah. yeah. But they're not doing that. Yeah. So now they want to go on hunger strike. I'm saying that the police is <laughs> already <laughs> food anyway. But like already that, we don't have food and you for see, you. for me, it shouldn't have been a problem to, for the police. Yeah. But <laughs> one, thing, one thing is that, one thing I have observed yeah. is that if you challenge them, they would... They would oh, no, they'll show you something. They'll show you something. Oh, so they did. Yeah, they did. So they, and in the assembly, they said... He was compromising the other cell with state. Yeah. What what is yeah. the compromise? State. Yeah. He's telling he them was a hunger strike. Eat. And then he said they, they were all, all of them die. That was me, me, I actually expected a statement from the police. <laughs> and in the statement, I expected a confirmation. Right? <laughs> but not in your black and white confirmation. But immediately I got there and said he was trying to compromise, compromise. his security and he had to be restrained. He was he was uh, he, he in said the this process of, of the handcuff. Yeah, so he, they said they said he was resisting. That's the word. Once the police issue a statement and say that. Something happened to you because you were resisting. They beat you. Eh. They did. Oh, yeah, yeah. They beat you. Oh, yeah. See, no ifs, no, no buts. They beat him. Ah. Why, why the resistance? Ah. They beat you. See, because sometimes when they want to beat you first, they will say, you are resisting. You are resisting. Yeah. They want everybody to know that you are resisting. <laughs> they, want, they want that on record. <laughs> no, but, you see, they... Ghana's police service as well. They oh, have yeah. to do some interesting. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They become too predictable. Yeah. You mm. know, and sometimes, I mean, it's not sometimes. We see through <laughs> it. When you are not being truthful, we see it. Yeah. I mean, because tell me how you give yourself out and say that there were minor scratches that required the person going to the police hospital. Minor scratches. You don't go to the police hospital. Don't you have first a Jenshi violence? <laughs> eh? Hydrogen peroxide. Uh, yes. Oh, yeah. uh, and they're saying that they are mo- they've been moving heaven and earth to be able to m- get him to meet his bail conditions. The guy says he has suspended in solidarity with his colleagues. Uh, so he won't leave. <laughs> they beat him again. <laughs> hey, but it's not acceptable. I no, mean, it is. It is not acceptable. How, not how accept- is this acceptable? It's not acceptable it's not. at all. And it's not. You know, this mentality of a bitch will be big cry. It has yeah. to stop. It has yeah. to stop. I mean. Um, I'm done. I'm mean, whose turn is are you done with it? Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. Okay, so I th- I've seen the digital copy of the daily graphic mm-hmm. front page Supreme Court ruling not binding NDC caucus in parliament. You see, right now it's becoming difficult to call minority or majority because yeah. that yeah. thing, you know, you, so know, you, you, see, yeah. you, you see that thing, yeah, <laughs> yeah, and so when you are calling it as then you are being attacked, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. And yesterday I noticed that when um Kweku Asante of Joy was asking and he said leader, yeah. and they said refer to him as majority leader, then um um at two forces said, Oh you it's okay, he said yeah. leader. <laughs> But you know, I think they were trying to. Yeah, uh, go go to, go yeah. back to uh, what, what happened for you, the yeah. MPP presser. Yes. And yeah, yeah. But at that time, it was what it was. Yeah. The NPP was the minority. Yeah. yeah. Because yeah. you don't have the numbers. Yeah. It's now that the Supreme Court has come in. You yes. have to defer to Speaker. Yes. Now we have tomorrow. To we'll, to yeah. Tomorrow we'll see clearly. Where who, we is minority, who is minority? Who is majority? Who is majority? Who is majority leader? And, and that's if the thing happens. No, but you see, the thing is, I, w one thing I'm, I'm also wondering is that, as much as the majority or as, as much as the NPP caucus is fighting mm -hmm. this, the people in question will they come and sit with them to vote? Okay, so here's the thing: two of them are no who show up. So the NDC guy Aka will come. Uh, Formina will come. Yes. No, I'm talking Cynthia. about the, Cynthia and the other. And, they uh, they, they, uh, they, they won't come to Palace, they won't come. That's the point. And you see, the, even the voting, the worst of it is that the Coco MP is immobile. You are, so, you are, okay, he's unable to move. Even, you guys but, are, are forgetting that there's Eugene entry in Parliament. <laughs> OECD. Ah! There should be a... There should be a... There should be a... Who, who, see, has, see, who broke ranks? See, I think three or so years what ago. It, in fact, there won't be any decision that will require yeah, yeah, that. Yeah. Voting by securities. Now, otherwise, this government is fried. I'm not sure they know yeah. that. Yeah. They know that. Apia Kubi, you can't trust him. Ah. There's, there's, there's Eugene <laughs> Kiri, you can't trust. <laughs> my point is that... The, there's the Carlos Ahimkra. You get it. The way they are fighting it. I'm wondering, yeah. if you if everything boils down to voting, voting by the numbers, yeah. will they get the numbers no, they are looking oh, for? No, for that one. Oh, yeah. well. Let's see how it unfolds. I mean, all eyes on Parliament tomorrow, really. Yeah. I can't wait for it. God just grant us life. Amen. And we'll see it. Um, so... Other stories here. Government grooming graduates for modern times. Dr. Matthew Poku Prempe. Tertiary Business Sense Challenge final tomorrow. And NEIP to equip 100,000 youth with vocational skills. And um, so NEIP and the National Youth Authority. Yes. Youth. Or Youth Employment Agency. Uh -huh. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. YEA. Yeah. What is the difference? Okay. So because NEIP, NEIP is going is to train 100,000 youths yeah. in, with vocational training. That's just, something why he is just also for doing. entrepreneurship. Okay. NEIP is just for entrepreneurship. I think that's so they were supposed the to, they Or they overlap. Yes, no two ways about that. And I think NEIP was set up to groom Ghanaian entrepreneurs, give okay. them financial support, technical know-how, and what have you. Okay. And why he is supposed to employment, sometimes okay. temporary employment, to give you the experience to get into the job market. Mm -hmm. But now, yes, I agree that the lines have been very blurred, and they all do things that yeah. Yeah, overlap. All right. Um, that will be it for the Daily Graphic newspaper. I'm done with that. Okay, so let me give you the Herald this morning. Ghana's democracy caught up in Game of Thrones as MPs, Supreme Court judges, tussle over rule of law and highlight of NDC and PP manifestos on health. NLA's Brennan Hall gets major facelift after many years. And Yoko staff's bust for COP Mamitiwa sparks controversy <laughs> over <laughs> approval <laughs> and venue. Over Tampa. So it's people cannot celebrate their boss in peace anymore. Listen. She was, she was, she was surprised. I mean, she <laughs> never knew about this. And we were saying, hey, for a security, <laughs> for a head of a security. You know, but last, last, if staff do know. bust for you, you have changed your salaries. <laughs> and it is significant. Hey. It's all by maybe a, a thousand margin. This one, it's uh, it is almost on the scale of before yeah. giving himself shash and, and this thing. No, that thing that he gave himself. But this one, she didn't commit. She didn't it. do it too. Uh, she was surprised. The staff yeah. were overwhelmingly mm. grateful for the changes so, that so, they have uh, so witnessed. Like, so, so by inference, is it, is it to mean that she's the best Yoko Look, boss? If if let me let me tell you. Me, she's a this mother is, for This is what I believe. Imagine you were earning... Thousand five, exactly. mm. and you get a new boss. Bosses have come, bosses yeah. have come, but, and yes. Mm. And you get a new boss that comes and elevates you from thousand five to six thousand. Mm. Would you not see the person as about ah. a That's the point. Me, we are even It's about the conditions of service. That's mm. it. And what you are getting. And it is welfare. Oh, you see the yeah, yeah. welfare. Talent. You should keep on keeping on. And you know, you know that 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 Yoko is allowed to keep part of the money it recovers mm. by law. That's mm. right. Tell me. What the are you woman talking is about? just making eh. the people feel comfortable. Chale, allow, allow cash out. Allow cash out. Allow. Yeah. Allow cash out. Allow. Next time we also so, get so, so, so at the point don't get space at Yoko. Let me talk. 
I'm saying at a point, they won't get a place to even do other things because every boss that can. Okay, we'll put something. <laughs> we'll put no, something no, there. See, there's only one over Unless they do it like, like I've <laughs> they'll put one on top of the other. Like they are doing their own statue of liberty. There's only one over Tampa. And they can actually buy a piece of land somewhere. And be and really then, that's the point. <laughs> no, so I was, uh, I was, uh, I, I know someone there. And yeah. I was like, hey, Charlie, why people want me this? Yeah. And he said, oh. In fact, they, they are happy. Yes. They are but they went, uh, he went to a social media like, people were angry. Why? Why? <laughs> I, I, hey, I is said, it your bust? Is it your bust? <laughs> I said, I said, the bust <laughs> brother doesn't look like the Uber. No problem. Hey, the old woman was excited. She was happy. Yeah, the whole, all over the world. No bust looks like the winner. Oh, have you seen that? <laughs> that Santa Hene one looks uh, like him. That one is a golden stone one. I <laughs> bet. <laughs> but the point we are making is that the Yoko people are happy. You guys are here catching feelings. Just say, it's shocking. We no, have, mama, I just, we see, see, no, we, we are in Ghana. Now they did. We saw when the police service headquarters. Yeah. yeah. They did that nice. Yeah. And, yeah, yeah. And fro- yeah. The fire service replicated. Yeah. Prison service the yeah. same. Now that Yoko boss has been given a bus. I hope we 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 yeah, we, know, we are in Ghana. We know how these things <laughs> yeah, happen. Yeah. But the time you realize it has become a new trend no, where no, no, no problem. As long as first of all, the procurement processes are good. In fact, these ones they welfare people. They went. They just went for there. They didn't use your good no. money. Mm. They, they. You see, when you get good it's, welfare, mm. you tip away small, small mm. welfare. Put them together. Or about Tampa because yes. she has overseen the well-being. Of, of all the stuff. Yeah, okay. Yes. And of they are bearing the testimony. Absolutely. So Let you guys know. can cry blood. Let we will be. build another bus. They'll keep Let on them. keeping keep on. <laughs> <laughs> Let them be. Let them be. Let them. If you want a bus and you are my boss, you know what to do. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Sort yeah. me. Sort yeah. me. Sort yeah. me. Oh, so this very, one, very this one is an appeal to Jojo. <laughs> sort us. We will put a bus in front of And it will look like you. In fact, it will be like an AI. The man will need to act surprised now that people have told him. <laughs> so, boss. Ah, oh, we have to even do the same thing too for. I think, I think, I think, no, I think I even needs a bus. My color celebrity. We have to create a bus for her. We have to do something for Bola too. <laughs> yeah, yes. Yeah, so, yeah, boss Bola. Yeah. Yes. We are. We want. We want to surprise you. That's true. Yeah, so you yeah. to surprise us. Surprise us. Yeah. <laughs> so, and then, in fact, we will put it in this studio. Morning star. When it's morning star, we will put the bus here. Hey. Yes. <laughs> we have mi- we have mini versions. Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, we wear it. Yeah. We wear the bust. Yes. So please. Wow, lo. Power to the people. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Are you done with the hair? It's herald? a busty morning. Ah. And then <laughs> <laughs> Wait. We didn't hear that. Continue. <laughs> so eight police officers allegedly beat a ninja back and former in custody. Oh, he actually counted them. They were eight. <laughs> Yoko. <laughs> Yoko. <laughs> But so what's the, what the problem? Why is he still in, in custody? It's in solidarity. In solidarity. solidarity. So he, he, he hasn't even kicked, started the process. He hasn't suspended it. Yeah. So you in can, demand if, for better conditions for those on remand. Yeah. Um, ah. So that's what he meant, they meant by he wanting to compromise. The, the guy that's fighting the for the hunger them. strike. That's the yeah. hunger strike. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. The hunger strike. He said that the people managed to... He, um, after she, he argued out this case, people believed in the cause. Ah, they said they were not going to eat. They said they were ah, that's the But that's way. a legitimate protest. <laughs> And yeah. that is what the police but is saying. Another way to be chaotic. Is <laughs> How? No, they say they won't eat. Yeah. But unless you won't treat them like kids. You know, when you are a kid, uh, you are yeah, 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 they will hold your nose no, face and they will clean your mouth. It's then... problematic if four, four or five prisoners suddenly this condition gets worse. No, the they are saying they are going to hang us right. So, uh, you know, my see, we have been in Ghana for too long. Go to the Far East and what have you. It's the only protest you know. Hunger strike. But you see something. If if the police can be upset about a hunger strike. How about they being upset about the terrible conditions under yeah, which the guys women are They're not upset about the hunger strike. No. They're upset about the individual that is pushing for the hunger strike. You know, so <laughs> it's it, it, because it is sometimes we just focus on the individual and not look at the main problem yeah. that we have at hand. Yeah. There are so many people on remand yeah. in terrible conditions. Some of them, they say their dockets are missing. Oh, yeah. And it's a reason we had <laughs> Justice for All program being yeah. rolled out. Do you understand? Yeah. Because a reporter highlighted, Seth Kwame Watting, yeah. highlighted the terrible conditions in, under which our prisons were and how people who had been on remand for so many years were not getting yeah. um, the necessary attention. But yep. hey, this is gone. We move. Mm. Um, okay, so um, okay, so that's it for the Herald this morning. All right. All right, the Republic Press newspaper, Baumia mocks NDC over 24 hour majority status. It appears the NDC is synonymous with 24 hours. So yeah. change for our economy now, majority, majority status. What, NDC, what, if, what if they are able to extend it tomorrow? Tomorrow, there has to be pay per view. Who, who manages the parliament's social and, media account? And what if tomorrow never comes? 
Oh, it will come. This one needs to come. Tomorrow, never <laughs> this one needs to come. I, 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 I want to be in the, the in the in the it house will... of Speaker Bagbin. Yeah, and know the number of people who've been calling, the kind of people who've been yeah. calling. Yeah, people stop, 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 stop being too expectant. Before you know, the trumpet will blow. Then uh, no rapture. Then, yeah. Rapture will come and then, then we will go. Yeah. Yeah. People who <laughs> <will, laughs> we are still prepared yet. Yeah, some people owe me. Let me let me <laughs> let my <laughs> manifest. <laughs> there are people who will beg on. They say beg, we beg you. This rapture yet. Let Tuesday pass first. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you don't be too anxious. You know, sometimes when you are too anxious, then it will be anticlimax. Yeah. So I think that they can happen. Mm. Don't worry. <laughs> game of like you said, game of thrones. Yes. And when Afonyo was insisting that he should be referred to as a yeah, yeah. majority leader, that yeah. that uh, popular quote from Tyrion Lannister yeah. that if a king insists that he's yeah. a king, yeah. he's, he's no, no true king. king. Yeah. So it is what it is. Anyway, <laughs> still with the Republic Press newspaper, NDC vows to defend majority seats despite Supreme Court's ruling. Also, Salifu Amwako defends son. You said Salifu. 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 <laughs> Salif Wamwaku defends San says he didn't carry a gun to kill. I I felt so sad and uncomfortable hearing that from the man of God. Let Look. me tell you something. I was not comfortable with the timing the apology video was released. Mm, mm. And so I was not surprised when um, those comments were equally made. Because I don't think he has really done an introspection. You have no idea. And um, uh, I think... One person that has just um, echoed my sentiment about this whole thing is Arnold Asamoah over the weekend when he was on United yeah. Showbiz. The way he said it is how I feel. Yeah. Look, these people have lost precious lives. Yeah. And they would never see them. You know, do you know that pain of raising a child to the age of 12? Yeah. Mm. And you are expectant of the so many things she's going to bring in the future yeah. and to have her die in that circumstance it's so heartbreaking you you will never recover from it yeah. look that speed was only going to cause one thing yeah. it was going to kill yeah and it has killed innocent lives it's a residential area for crying out loud how do you go at that speed even how? for those who suffered, I mean, how? survived, those who mm -hmm. survived, imagine the trauma they will have to live with how do you do that? for the rest of their lives because of your recklessness, because your son decided yeah. to, to, to drive recklessly. And you know, for me, I keep saying that if I, who I have no relationship with these people, I feel this way. Mm -hmm. how, look, I saw, I saw the video of the mother wailing. You can see that this is the, the kind of pain that nothing is unex it's inexplicable. Yeah. Yeah. The agony. Charlie. You didn't even get to say goodbye. No. Because of the, the nature. You can't even feel your daughter yeah. because she's charred. Like, yeah. no, um, like, keep quiet. See that um, man, keep quiet. Don't talk. I'm looking at I don't want to hear you. I'm looking at a picture of the big sister to one of the deceased ah. girls. And she's crying and sobbing. Right. Ah. You see, that's how heartbreaking it is. I have been told and I gather that... The coat, the news card has been taken out of contest, and that he was admonishing his church members mm -hmm. that some of them have become overly defensive. Yeah, that was in so, relation to the assault on our journalists. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some of them have become overly defensive. Uh, they go somewhere, somebody is talking about the incident. They, the church members, do not know the entire story, they don't have the facts, they don't have the details, and they go about saying things and doing things. Mm -hmm. He was once somewhere and somebody was commenting about the development he felt the story was not the way it was being portrayed mm. he got up and then left without uttering a word and so he was asking the church members to not to be same. overly defensive that one is there yeah and then yeah so he went ahead so, to talk about so the fact i mean that the bit accident. about he cautioning and chastising his that, people that's that, that, right that is the that is the right thing to do yeah. that's i mean and we have heard it yeah. we'll see what we'll do with it yeah. But the moment you say it was an accident, I have maintained that it was no accident. It was a car crash. Yeah. And okay, so the, the opposite of an accident is deliberate, right? Yes. It cannot be deliberate. It can be reckless. Listen. It, it cannot be deliberate. The difference between an accident is that yeah. nobody was at fault. No. For as, an accident... can happen as a result No, no. Now, the thing is that... Is, somebody's recklessness yeah so yeah. when it's an accident paza okay. it happened nobody could do anything about oh, okay. it it, okay. it like 
it was uncontrollable. Like the brake just failed. Yes. I mean, you, there's but then a car crash is when somebody's action leads to the to it. Somebody on the road. So nothing malfunctioned. Nothing malfunctioned. Of course. The other That's guy was in his lane. Yeah. If the other guy had st- stuck to the speed limit, we would not be here. Obviously. And why I will not categorize it as a as an accident because it wasn't. And when you are riding at that speed, you know the outcome. It was bound to happen. You are not on a Formula One race. You are not Lewis Hamilton. Okay. All right, let me finish with the Republic Press. Um, Vomawa was not beaten by police. Um, also, um, the one Ghananese, Alan Chamantin, and he, he, uh, over the weekend, I understand that a lot of people patronize Lafra Franto Health Work. Oh, yeah, I'm let's told, see. Uh, I think Essential Region has become a harbinger for health works. Mm. The NEC called the NEC, health yeah, Bantama. Work, uh, Bantama. It's interesting why the NEC chose Bantama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We will come after you. Ayariga tells resigned government appointees. Details on page nine. I'm done with the Republic Press. Ah. Um, I'm the just looking at the picture. Light. Yeah. The, the big sister. The big sister. Yeah. She was the one who apparently came out of the car first. first. Wow. And their little sister is still in the hospital trying the, to recover. You see, that's the point look, I'm making. Look at the agony. She will be traumatized yeah. for, for, for look, life. Yeah. Look, Charlie, let me and, not and, and go all the way and break down. They don't even get the bodies of their loved ones to lay them in states that's how terrible it is like you can't put a face to the last moments of oh your God. loved one and personally there's a special reason why i don't watch dead bodies because the last image i want to have of you of the, is the image of you being alive right and to see that this is the trauma these family members are going through like i said and i sat here and said this see nobody wins in this Sally for Makun's family never wins. The victim's families never win. The best we can do is to manage the way we communicate. It's very important. I'm talking about, uh, especially the Sally for Maku family, is to manage the way they communicate and the way they speak to us. I prefer they, would, they, sh- they should just be quiet. They should just be quiet. That's it. Because you know sometimes, eh, when you lose somebody and it was preventable, yeah. And some and the other persons whose action led to it. Yeah. You hear them talk. It it, it aggravates you. your pain. Yeah. So it, just like how when somebody is grieving and they are next to you, yeah. you don't have to necessarily mm-hmm. be blurting out it is well, it is well, it is well. Sometimes all they just need is for you to listen yeah. and hold them close. And yeah. that's all they need. Yeah. So we beg them, they should keep quiet. They shouldn't aggravate the pain of the bereaved families. True. Daily satellite, an unnecessary constitutional crisis. NDC caucus defies Supreme Court uh, battles, fisticuffs <laughs> expected in Parliament this week. Oh, then they will disappoint you. <laughs> uh, they say they will defend the Constitution. And how how if, are they going to do it? I'm coming. And if <laughs> what you describe as chaos is what it will take, mm. so be it. And I am quoting. Governor Kwame Abuja has said that he's picked intelligence. And mm. there's military the men closer. You know, blue, Parliament is very close to Blue Gate. In fact, blue it's now gate, much yes. more closer to the Blue Gate. You can just jump from the Grand Arena and land in Kandapa's mm. office. Right. Good. And uh, how is that also special about it? Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> and so, <laughs> therefore, they say that they pick so intelli- therefore, say. Therefore, mm. <laughs> they say that they have picked intelligence, that the military will be deployed again. They say they are waiting for them. But then we also uh, address the military directly that there's the last thing you want to do at this material point yeah, in time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I think that uh, if, if indeed that is what is being considered, they should reconsider. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's happened once, it shouldn't happen twice. Nobody wins. It's a democratic yeah. establishment. Oh, no, that, that would be an embarrassment yeah. for us. I, mean, I, I don't think anybody, they do any right thinking no, Ghanaian want to embarrass, any right thinking Ghanaian want to embarrass all of us like nah. that. Ah. Yeah, this one there, I'll, 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 I'll believe my Let people. Let this cap yeah. This one there, <laughs> trust me. <laughs> VIP, Baumia Commission Phase 2 of Chado Hydro Power Plant, hey. fulfills promise to Hohoi EPSHS. Chado. There's, okay. You said Hohoi, and you allowed him. Chachadu. Let me see. Chachadu. Ever, ever, you can't see. Chachadu. Oh, yeah. I can't see. Yeah. Chachadu, Chachadu. Huh? Chachadu. That's Chachu, Chachu, Chachu. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. It's Chachadu, yes. <laughs> so why do you say Chadu? No, I wanted to give people something. <laughs> I haven't gotten anything yet. 
I want to give people something. I haven't gotten anything yet. No. In your own clip. Okay, then it will come. I want to give people Nonsense. Let us keep working hard for decisive victory in December. But my edges. Uh, Kwa Hine still opposed uh, <laughs> the, the, the drama and then you cut, you cut, you slaughter animal around and then do all the right and then after that you come and tell us that. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Who are you kidding? Who are you kidding? <laughs> and then uh, it's, it's reminiscent of this saying that say, uh, mm, uh, to, to wait. <laughs> 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 it's later, you say that she's still, she's still mm. it. It's your cup of tea. So, uh, final headline here. I am still strong because of my Ashanti spirit. Alan is saying Alan, Alan is saying that he's seen strong because it's, it's, he's spending 20 days in Ashanti mm. alright the Insights newspaper is the last one I have and day of shame in Ghana renowned Chinese intellectual to speak at 58th anniversary of Nkrumah's overthrow comes with a picture of Osage for Dr. Kwame Nkrumah the other Osage for <sighs> Is no, that's how you feel. It's fighting, still fighting. It's still fighting. Yeah, yeah. he just fighting has played some the small minor, the minor injuries and he's been taken care of. Also, you know, one of the people I, I wish I, I met in Kruma would have been in Kruma, yes. Yeah. yeah. His but, mind is. But you met Seku. Oh. <laughs> um. <laughs> why you, why you why, why do you have a problem with Seku? I'm um, we. Oh, hey. sorry. <laughs> hey. <laughs> nah. ah. What's happening? <laughs> I beg. Can we be serious? Um, <laughs> yes, proceed. <laughs> All right. <Opua. laughs> See, that shall not lead me to temptation. Opoku Ajiman blast NPP Baomia over economic mismanagement, Galamse, corruption, others. Also, Okaman land case, tension mounts as chief prosecutor faces accusation of aiding land guards to evade justice. NEIP skills for job projects launched. Details on page three. And the last headline here, how U.S. How United States is destabilizing East Asia, a regional perspective, page six and seven, um, have details of this headline. Yeah. All right. The informal newspaper, Ibrahim Alassan. The informal newspaper <laughs> here says, declaring seats vacant, Professor Fault Speaker argues declaration of intent doesn't shift allegiance. This allegiance, again. Yeah, that Professor Kwekwaza. You are Okromouth. Hey, you are okra mouth. I equal to mocks NDC. Uh, we won't accept LGBTQI plus activities. Dr. Mahmoud Baumia says so. Brains build nations, not natural resources. Napo extols virtues of free SHS. And you know, you guys, I'll give you some gist when we get off air. Mm -hmm. Towards improving lotto operations, NLA outdoors refurbished Brennan Hall. And NDC MPs threaten showdown. But law professor advises parliament to um, comply with the order. Okay, so the custodian is the final one I have. Baumia mocks dreamy NDC over manufactured majority in parliament. Saglimi housing project gets investor and NSE uses technology to eliminate fraud. Akufuado opens biggest urology and nephrology center. Okay, urology and then nephrology center uh, here. Uh, yeah, so that's it for the custodian. So I think you can take us online. All right. Um, the Daily Dispatch newspaper okay. front page: Supreme Court orders uh, Parliament to put on hold, put a hold on Speaker's ruling out outsting four MPs. All the seven seats is it seven seats? All the seven seats that have been declared vacant in Ghana's eighth Parliament. Okay, oh, I'm sure it is over the period. Yeah, yeah. And can MPP maintain its grip on Ayawaso West Wogan seat? That's it for the Daily Dispatch newspaper. Okay. So All right. You take us on. Um, the process, you start for me because okay, I'm not. So, sitting in this room, does the Supreme Court consider public opinions in its rulings? Hannah Tete asked. Uh, that's hey, the former Foreign Affairs Minister. She's now with the. She's a, with the UN. UN, UN yeah. yeah in, uh, Stop talking. My son didn't kill anyone with a gun. Sally for And And, okay, so, okay. So, the stop talking no, is the one that <laughs> was directed at the, the church workers. members. Yeah. Uh, we will jealously protect our new majority status at of forcing. You've disgraced me. Sally for who condemns attack on journalists. Parliamentary majority is won at the polling station, no manufactured Baumia. Please deny beating Baka Vomawo. Record number of Ghanaians and Nigerians deported from UK in a single flight. Mm. Uh, just as we are record numbers are going, record numbers are coming. 
it, unfortunately. Zero. Imagine uh, those who have just come. The sorrow in their families. Sometimes a busy good year. They sold the family jewelry. Still people are doing that. Uh, they do. It's okay. You have sometimes one plot of land. <laughs> we occupy majority side in Parliament. <laughs> 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 they are not serious, so I don't even know what to do with you this morning. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Yeah, darling. Yes. Alban Bagman is a good man. He deserves to be where he is. That's according to Professor Mike Aranoque. Um, thirty percent of students bleaching Eastern region. That's what the education that, director that, is that, saying. That's moderate. Charlie, if you look at uh, you just in fact the survey I think you just go to Instagram and TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they'll find them there. You know, in the past, yeah, the 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 claim was that people who were bleaching yeah. were not enlightened. Exactly. But it has uh, totally shifted. Now it's called shifted. skin tone. Look, <laughs> there are so many things people use these days yeah. where they are not using the harsh yeah. uh, creams in the yeah. past that you see the blemishes yeah. and everything. People are doing infusions. Yeah. People are doing pills yeah. now and all that. And yeah. so um, it's, it's endemic and there has to be a way for us to rethink. But yeah. it's also because of what we project exactly. in the media yeah. consistently. Uh, it's a obako kodiana. Yeah. So yeah. obako kodampe. Yeah, 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 those things. Uh -huh. All those things. Uh -huh. yeah. Those things reinforce um, all these uh, perceptions that yeah. if you are lighter, you yeah. are prettier. So. That's true. Um, but all that matters that you also need to be comfortable in your skin. In your skin, very yeah. important. No, regardless of what people say, yeah. we are all very unique. We can't all be the same. Other stories here. Education director condemns alleged gang rape involving Impriso SHS students. And um, Professor Michael Quay calls for institu institutionalized presidential debate in Ghana. Uh, we'll come after you, Ayariga tells resigned government appointees. And um, yes, that's about it yeah. um, in relation to what the portals are reporting that will be it for the newspaper review segment and uh, we'll go for a break when we return uh, we'll do first check do the uh, pardon court, court today N oh, okay i uh, will do first check and <laughs> and i think we should spend a good amount of time in parliament oh yeah we'll, we'll hear from the two sides we'll hear from at the least. two sides um the majority <laughs> the npp the leader of the npp group in parliament <laughs> Uh, Alexander Finio marking, and yeah. then the leader of the NDC group in parliament yeah. as well, and Dr. Cassie Lato for some brains yes. on the back. And uh, how exactly we should um, approach tomorrow yeah. and avert any chaos? Because everybody keeps saying, well, this parliament started on the notes of a fight. Yeah. Started with a fight. Are they going to end with another fight? Yeah, like, um, a, like a phoenix. <laughs> 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 well, um, we will be right back after this spot of commercials. This is the Morning Star here on Star 103.5 FM. Let's have breakfast. Morning Star. This is.